Hello! Welcome back to Thief! I'm Spencer. I'm Billy. And wait, we're not in the same spot we were last time. We're not in a tower. It, it looks like we... Yeah, uh, we missed some things. Like, recording didn't go well. We were recording yeah, we this. Yeah, kind of forgot to record the screen. But we have audio, and, uh... Lots of audio. I think the, <laughs> I think editor might throw some stuff in. And we also have a uh, impromptu uh, recap of the cutscenes that were missing from the recording. So... Yeah. Cue that, and we'll get back to this. Three, what? two, one. So now we're leaving the tower, and we're responding to a letter from our friend Basso, who's like, yo, dude, where the f did you go? So we're gonna go find Basso. Alright, so you're gonna pull out your bow, which is the easy retriever. There you go. I remember things! <laughs> You got this, dude. Oh, uh, I mostly ten I... North Crest. We've had ten, and this one's the worst of the lot. You can't blame him for the gloom. Oh, how about that? His watch of thugs in uniforms. I don't. Where know. the fuck is you? Listen to him talk. Where are these people? He They're very in what he was close. Doing. Running this place takes a firm hand. He wanted to improve things. Aye, he's so proud of his improvements that him and his firm hand haven't crossed the river in a year. Like I said, worst of the lot. Okay. <clears throat> I would have went for the pickle jar, Pass so a lot more weight. You would have went for the pickle jar. <laughs> Shh. I like his hat. He does, he does have rings. I thought both you and Aaron had been killed in the mansion attack. Where the hell have you been? I don't know. Look, it, it, look, I got, I hit a, I hit a blunt, and I was out for weeks. Yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> I, I swear, one day I'm gonna have you made into a hat. I get more you out. Wouldn't. You get more emotion out of that bird than you do from all the humans in Halo Five. <laughs> you walk a path, you. This is a green of and she's oddly uh, very well dressed for a beggar. Quite. She probably stole. Or had all the beggars like hive mind swarm people. <laughs> you know everything that happens in this city. Mm, Not everything. everything. Every Just oh. the important things. What wait 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 what counts as important? Uh who's got the biggest uh what brings you on here? the market? <laughs> That is, she is terrifying to look at. Wow, that was some great stuff. I can't believe the editor managed to throw it all together. He's got some real good talent. So, um... We're gonna go into look at a factory. I don't remember what the factory has. I think we're stealing stuff from it from, like, the captain there. Uh, no, but, um, you'll soon remember when we enter the chapter, so... <laughs> right, dust to dust. All I remember is there was a key that looked like a skyscraper, and that's where we ended. Well, we, we did, and, and then we had to start over, because it's recording. Yeah, <laughs> so, forget it, but sickness and streets, there's no rose garden, everything's changed, but not for the better. Wow, speed reader. That's how I re read like uh, t textbooks in college. This is why I don't do own classes. Uh -huh. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I'm really thorough with everything I do. And... Ah, all right. This is the the mannequin factory where they take the corpses and stuff them. Hmm. Oh, and since the other recording went out the window, uh, you might notice my voice is deeper. I finally hit puberty. <laughs> wow. It only took all of high school. Yep. And a year of college. Mm -hmm. Oh, I don't think- oh, wait, so- okay, she doesn't- she's not the one with the, uh, earrings. Will she see me if I do this? Nope. Oh, a whole 19 years to get to this voice. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Wow, you know, I never forgot how to play. Uh, I got, I remembered. 
Alright, yeah, so there's some loot under that bridge. Right. Uh, yeah, you need to drop down. Yeah, and uh, you go down there. I think there's also loot on the beams up there, so... You know, once you grab that, go back up. Ah, I remember, I remember the, the, the Y button to look around for things. Yeah, for the glowy blue stuff. So if you go up there and go to the beams directly on the bridge, I think there's some loot there too. He can't, can't see you. <laughs> One thing I want to point out that what happened in the uh, previous recording that we did that was failed was we when we were in the safe area, I kept sneaking around thinking that everyone was a, a guard. Which yeah, ended we couldn't up. figure out how to draw the bow. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we thought everything was broken, and then we realized, oh, it's not broken, I just don't know better. Forget the glue. If I catch the founder and droop. Oh yes, and I did buy a screwdriver. In the original playthrough, that in my first playthrough, I completely ignored all the power-ups and upgrades. So I went through the whole game without a screwdriver or a knife or anything. Damn. And, uh... So I had to suffer through a lot of things. Yeah, I said this in the last one, but it wasn't heard, so we can I can talk about it again. And out of any consequence of people saying you already talked about this, Assassin's Creed Revelations that happened with me, where I went and I went through most of the entire game without purchasing any armor. Uh, I'll take that. I'll take that cup. I got a throwable. There's nothing else here. All right, and this is the swoop button. Hmm. Yeah, so congrats, you just sneak packs all those guards and a dog in a cage that would have barked at you. Oh man, a fucking dog? Yeah, there's nobody around here, so you can like free, freely run. Wee! I can be as loud as I want. Get it. Aaron. And you're gonna approach that flower. All right, this is and that is how you restore your eye thing. Well, we actually oh, bought a bunch of them. Uh, so. Right. Yeah, so that's your focus. Actually, you can replenish it and then just pick that up. All right, yeah, okay. I got my water arrows. All right, now you're going to climb the pipes. Oh, there's a thing over there. Yeah. Okay, I remember this. We just get to it. Just uh, your average everyday plumber, just checking out the plumbing, making sure things are good. You never can be too Nothing sure. Let's see here, guards. Hep. Oh, right, we're robbing a dead guy. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> it just <laughs> came to me. <laughs> I completely forgot. I'm like, we're robbing someone. I don't know who. And then it just hit me. Okay, and... Have you ever wanted to crawl in like air air ducts before? Yeah, but then I'm afraid of getting stuck and then overheating. I am I'm I was always interested in doing it as a kid because it looked like it was like a thing you had to climb. It looked like something you could go into. Right. Mannequins. I can get a little for the body, but not this kind. Okay. Remember when you got a uh, spotted up here? I did it? Yeah. Uh, like, it was in that room over there. Okay. So you guys gotta be stealthy and careful. Hmm. Yeah, so get that uh, shiny thing. You can keep going up those steps and then go over that. Yeah, I believe this room. Oh, yeah, there's nothing in here. Just people. Not people. There's there's no people in here, just treasure. Yep. Nothing in there. Anything else? 
All right, a chest. This is a very shallow chest when you think about it. I don't think it. we got this one last time, so good thing you looked huh. around. All right. Uh, I think there's something on top of the bookshelf, perhaps, behind you. Oh. Maybe not. There's no jump button, I um, realized. Probably just seeing things. Okay. So that leaves downstairs. Okay. It doesn't matter. You gotta be careful because there's people there. Oh, the entry is broken glass in, in this level. I remembered. Yep. Oh, and the crossbows. Yeah, so we're gonna go up and knock that guy out once you get around uh, that away. This would have passed for respect in a slaughterhouse. You can jump to that part. Uh, <laughs> oh, crap. Yeah. Oh well. It's only like five gold. Hi. Just stay in the shadows. They can't. If I if I can't see them, they can't see me. Sure. Nice to run on forever. Yeah. Just gonna wait till you go away. Oh, he's moving. <laughs> oh. Hmm. Yeah, go on. Oh, that takes me up. Careful. You can knock him out. Or take pocket first, then knock him out. Uh, and you gotta move him out of the light so his buddy doesn't find him. Come on, into the shadows, into the shadows. Look, here's a nice little... Take a nap. He actually looks like he's napping. Yeah. Okay. Score one. He actually got someone to look like they're napping. That's good for once. In the first Thief game, the, the bodies are really funny because they're literally just like T-pose. <laughs> and they, they remain rigid when you throw them to the ground. <laughs> That's beautiful. Oh. Okay. Let's go down here. Ooh. Someone has a smoke break down here. Don't mind if I do. No one here. So how about that storm the other day? Oh, wow. That's... Okay, that storm, I was at work, and there was barely anything except for just thunder and some light rainfall before, like, the heavy parts hit. But with you, something really bad happened. Oh, yes, yeah, so, uh, so I have, uh, trees in my yard, as most people do. Yeah? They're, they're very big trees, very sturdy. Normally, they don't, like, drop huge branches when it storms or hurricanes, but, uh, these were 80 mile per hour winds and heavy rainfall. And, um, well, some giant branches fell and blocked off my front door. And it took me, my mother, who is completely ripped, so, like, she can lift pretty much anything. Yeah, she's full. And two other neighbors to get these branches out from the front door so we can actually use that entrance. And not only that, our umbrella on the deck, um, got busted and then out back behind our shed uh where we have like our lawnmower and generator and things a tree that was on the other side of the fence uprooted yeah but the roots were so wide that they were on our side of the fence 
and when it tipped up, it like moved the fence up and also brought the generator with it. So the generator's just sitting on top of the roots right now. I have pictures. Yeah, so. I, I saw that. Like when you saw that picture, I'm like, oh my gosh, that is insane. Mhm. Mm so it sucks now because uh, uh, the guy has another um, pocket. Oh. Tree, but uh, it sucks now because um, that tree blocked the view of my job from my bedroom window, so now I have to constantly look at the roof of my job. <sighs> uh. Not fun. Yeah. All right, we're going to throw you over here so you stay nice and warm, and we will see you guys next time on Thief. Theft. <laughs>